So I'm here today with um with world famous whatever he does. Um deer, deer hunter. Yeah, so it's nice to meet you. Yeah, definitely, yeah. Thanks for having so, me. Yeah, it's an honor to meet you. You're my hero. Okay, so I'll be asking you a few questions. The first question is, what is your favorite book? Uh, my favorite book, huh? Well, it would probably have to be uh, On the Origin of Species by Charles Darwin. It was very enlightening. I learned a lot from that book. Okay, what was your favorite movie? Hmm, uh, I've read a lot of, I've, uh, you know, watched a lot of movies. Uh, but my favorite one of all time would probably have to be something like Star Trek IV, uh, The Voyage Home. That is a good movie, I'll tell you that. Okay, so, um, next question, what's your favorite color? Mm, black. Okay. What's your favorite animal? Well, most people would think that my favorite animal would be a uh, cat tiger, but it's actually the porcupine. Porcupines are resilient. I want to be just like a porcupine. All right. They're cool animals, I guess. Next question, what's your favorite cartoon? Cartoon? I don't have much time to watch cartoons when I'm out in the wilderness. I mean, I watched an episode of, what was that, the author show one time? But I was like six years old. Of course, I was in Nepal scaling Mount Everest. And I was in base camp and I watched it and I was like, I'm bored, I'm gonna go climb mountain. You scaled in Mount Everest when you were six? No, I was actually five. No, five and a half. Five and a yeah, half. Five and a half. Now, what other questions? Um. What was your, um, who was your first crush? Mm. Well, I didn't, I didn't fall in love until I was older because there was, when I was at boarding school, and the, board, the boarding school was, uh, it was all boys, right? And, um, so I was at an exhibition in Africa, right, when I was 18 years old, and I met this one girl named Sylvia, and she was amazing, I tell you, she was... She was intelligent and funny, and she was what they call super hot, right? And then she got eaten by lions. It was, it was difficult. I was sad about it for a while. Actually, I'm still sad about it, and that's why I have crippling depression. Okay. So what was your favorite expedition? Ooh. Well, I can think of two. There was one time I was in Australia, right? And, um... I got lost in the outback, and I ran out of water. I had to resort to drinking my own urine, and the urine of my companions, and kangaroo urine. Here's a fun, here's a tip for you kids: uh, never drink kangaroo urine. You hear that, guys? Don't Death drink kangaroo. Ca don't to drink kangaroo, kangaroo urine. Urine. Can, can it even see me? I can't. Probably. See, I, that's where I got this shirt. Right, I made it out of my own hair. Look at this shirt. Nice. To remember my time in Australia. It looks kind of different from your hair. Australia. Yeah, well, I dyed it. You dyed your hair or you dyed the shirt? Both. Oh. Okay. What other questions you got for me? Um, this is the last question. What was your most traumatic cat tiger experience? Hmm. Well, that would probably have to be my other expedition that I remember. I was in a, I was in a terrible place called New York City, right? And I was lost and there were enemies everywhere. There were, there were horrible things like taxis. And the the Statue of Liberty and the Yankees. It was a terrible place, I will say. And I was I'm, I'm surprised I made out alive. But that's where I first got mauled by a cat tiger. He was wandering the streets, and I said, "Hey, that's a cat tiger." I know cat tigers because I studied them when I went to Oxford. I studied cat tigers. I majored in cat tiger studies, and I minored in tiger cat studies. Now, tiger cats are, of course, larger than cat tigers. And then I'll go into this some other time. But, so, I got mauled by a cat tiger, and I lost this arm, and I lost this arm, and they just grew back, okay? Because I'm at that, I have that, that physique to be able to survive a cat tiger, right? When you're this small, you can survive anything. Physique. Okay. Um, well, that's all, so it was a pleasure to meet you. Well, naturally, there are other times I, I got killed by cat tigers. I have been killed about 15 times okay, by shut cat tigers. So it was a pleasure to meet well, you. There was that one time when the cat tiger fried my brain. And Dude, I shut up with the station man. He was going to find out I stole his camera. Is that his camera? Yeah. And then there was other time when I went to someone's here. house and they beat me up. 
Yeah, you're right about that. Okay, get out. No, they said it was All breaking right. and entering. Well, I'm sorry, but I have a job to do. You kind of would. All right. Wait, is the interview done? Yes. All right, Come goodbye. Here. Thanks.